5.41 a.m. We're on our way to Cancun. I've never seen the airport like this. It's empty and I'm loving it. It's time to go get some coffee. I haven't slept while someone was snoring. But... <laughs> this is my Santa Daddy. And when my baby yeah. <laughs> Cause I don't care All the bad things disappear Did you notice that the coffee hit me? <laughs> Welcome to Newark International Airport they scan you in the airports which is pretty cool because you don't have to stand in line or make a line or anything you just pass oh, I look cool in color what's up we made it we're here we're, we're waiting for our cab service to take us to the hotel um, there's nothing to it they didn't do anything to us that's different they kind of scan you but from afar taking your temperature for the COVID, but it's smooth sailing. Nobody asked us questions. No one came up to us. There was like nothing. Actually, it felt better because there was less people. It was smoother. You get by and that's it. I mean, that's amazing if you ask me. There you go. Yeah, yeah, she's good. She's high. Please wait for me. I gotta tell you what happened. So we come into the hotel and we're staying at the Crystal Cancun Hotel. And they take your temperature. Take mine and my temperature was high. I freaking panicked. I was like, what the hell? Like, I know I don't have the COVID because I already had it. Long story short, I just needed to cool off. My God, it's hot here. The mask has me really hot. But then after a few minutes, it was fine. I was just panicked. Now we're here at the beach. Look at this. Mamma mia. And Chris has his margarita. <laughs> Hola. Y bienvenido a Styling Your Lipstick. Oh. El pintalabio que tengo puesto para este video es by Sigma y se llama Secret Garden. And I'm coming to you from Cancun, bitches! This is the view. I'm on the bed. And this is the view. Mm -hmm. She can't get up. People are already in the beach. Obviously you have your safe, you have your mini bar. But this is the piece de resistance. Oh, and then you have a mirror. Hi! Oh my god! Hi! I'm wearing a Norma Kamali bathing suit and it has like that liquid leather look which I thought it was kind of fab <laughs> and you have your TV there <sighs> oh wow absolutely flawless this water looks like pool water look at that
morning guys it's officially the last day and we're about to go have breakfast then my camera would adjust buenos dias gracias buen dia gracias and this is the buffet and straight to the beach right there and there goes my babe to the beach they have a heated pool which is great for my skinny ass because i'm always freezing they have a jacuzzi i just wanted to tell you guys so far our experience really quick and briefly um they've been super lenient here at the hotel they are not on you just when you enter restaurants or where you're gonna go eat they ask you to wear your mask but once you're inside the place they don't harass you they give you the antibacterial gel and that's about it also you have to book early in the morning and reserve for dinner you have to get up super early if you're early bird it's no problem but if you miss that boat then you're done because they're full to capacity and then you won't be able to get any reservations i just had espresso so i'm ready to go i'm going to show you guys a little bit of the area so you can see but everything has been great so far except for that scare that I told you about but I'm just going to show you briefly in case you want to come to Mexico because it's very lenient now during the pandemic give this place a five the people are amazing here they are happy go lucky everyone's super friendly and they make you feel at home and safe in this resort food in my opinion i give it a three the food to be honest with you was not my favorite i found myself quite a few times kind of complaining about it just because the food tasted stale you could tell it wasn't fresh and I get that they're trying to be very selective in the amount of food that they're giving you just to conserve but it was to the point where I'm skinny I don't eat that much and I had to keep asking for another serving and another serving so that became somewhat annoying to a point so I personally give the food here during the pandemic a three drinks the Drinks here, I give it a three because they use a lot of like imitation juices. They don't use like natural juices from Mexico here and a lot of sugar and the alcohol. Again, I get it. They're trying to conserve and save money, but it's to the point where you notice the difference and the quality for me is diminished. They've been to other resorts where you're not necessarily getting top shelf, but the quality of the drinks, of the juices is fresh, and you can tell it's authentic from the country, and I did not get that here. Entertainment was a two. I only saw a performance for kids one night here, and I get it, it's during the pandemic. We're trying to practice your social distancing, so they're not going to condone 
the party atmosphere. As far as the pandemic, this is probably one of my favorite things that happened here. It was the fact that it did not feel like we were going through a pandemic. And that is what I was looking for, for an escape, even though you're still practicing your social distancing. They are strict here with their protocols as far as when you first go into a restaurant, you first go into a bar, you have to have your mask on. When you're close to people, you have to have your mask on. But it didn't feel like every two seconds you were dodging people, moving out of your way, acting strange, acting super paranoid. It was a completely relaxed atmosphere. And that's exactly what we were looking for that, yeah, we want to feel safe. But at the same time, we still want to, as much as we can, escape from the reality. Pandemic, escapism, I give it a five because I barely even thought about it here. It was amazing. Beach, the beach as you've seen in the B-rolls and the clips, it is a spectacular five. Love the beach. There's days that it was wild and rambunctious, just like me. There's days that it was super calm, crystal clear, like pool water. It was spectacular. I wish I could spend more time here, to be honest with you. The beach is a miraculous spot. And would I recommend this? I would recommend this if you have a family because I find this place to be very family oriented. It's great atmosphere for them. They have a lot of space. They have a kiddie pool. Here they had a lot of kid-like environment. I feel like this place caters more to like the family environment. If you guys have any questions, go ahead and leave them down in the comments down below. Don't forget to subscribe. Dale un like si te gusta. Hit the notification bell. 